What are filters? Moodle has a number of filters which affect how elements of the course are displayed. This video displays in its own player because the Multimedia Plugins filter has been activated. To see which filters your Moodle administrator has made available, we click the gear menu and then click Filters. Note that we can view and change filters for individual activities from the gear menu inside each activity as well. We are now on the Course Filter Settings page where we see a list of filters for the course such as the Multimedia Plugins filter which is on, hence we can display our sound and video files in a player. Activity names auto-linking is useful because it means we can refer to an activity simply by typing its name in a different part of the course and it will link to that activity. Display emoticons as images is another example of a filter and this would make punctuation such as a colon and a bracket turn into a smiley face automatically. Glossary auto-linking means that if we add a key term to a glossary and then type that key term somewhere on the course, it would automatically link to its glossary entry. Let's go into the course and add a couple of items to see how these filters work. So I'm turning the editing on from the gear menu and then in the course, in the section writing, let's type a sentence which includes two possible filters. So adjective would link to a glossary entry and this punctuation should turn into a smiley emoticon. If we now save the changes, there we have our smiley face and if we hover our cursor over the word adjective, it takes us to the glossary entry which we made in a previous video explaining about the glossary.